Welcome to another show, I'm Sid, and did you know that Bill Nye likes Instagram filters? Well, not technically Bill Nye, it's not the Bill Nye that you know, anyway. But there is a website, and I don't know if you've heard of it, but it catalogues every single Instagram filter tutorial that you can find on YouTube, all in one place. And you can browse through them by channel, by category, by country, language, and I'm gonna show you that now, so let's go. Okay, so here we are, welcome to Spark AR TV. As you can see at the top, this is Bill Nye's website. I don't know if that's 100% legit. Uh, it is spelled a little bit differently to the OG Bill Nye, but you never know. It is a GitHub, so the full domain is billnye.github.io forward slash spark, AR TV. I'll leave a link in the description in case you don't want to try typing that out for yourself. I recommend saving it to your favorites, bookmarking this site because it does update every single day and it's totally worth checking out. The first thing you'll notice on the homepage are all of yesterday's videos as of recording. This website updates every 24 hours so today's videos will appear tomorrow and the day after and the day after and it will just continue forever and as you scroll through the page you'll be able to see all the videos from previous days so you can keep going. I think as far back as 2019 is when it stops updating. Uh, that might just be when the first video was actually uploaded. There's plenty of content on here, hundreds if not thousands of videos for you to browse through. Uh, you can do it directly from the homepage or we can scroll all the way back to the top and you'll see we have some tabs along the top here. Uh, we also have some sidebar action on the left and on the right. On the right, we have featured contents, which usually is channels and videos that I guess are popular or trending or something within the community. I'm not sure how it ranks this kind of stuff, but it is interesting. And there are always new videos every time you refresh the page. You can sort by language. So if you only wanna see the English videos or the Russian videos, if we click Russian, for example, you'll be able to see just the videos that were uploaded in the Russian language. Uh, and as you scroll through, it organizes those by date as well, which I think is really cool. It's worth checking out some of these videos because even if you don't speak the language, oftentimes YouTube videos will have closed captions or subtitles and you'll be able to follow along that way or else the video will be primarily visual content. So even if you don't know what the person is saying, you'll be able to follow along step by step with their instructions. I myself have found a lot of cool techniques this way, just browsing through the site and looking for stuff with interesting thumbnails or a random keyword that I recognize but haven't found in English. So this is a cool way to decide discover new types of content and inspire yourself to make new filters. There are also categories down here on the left. So if you want 360 videos, then there are 17 of those cataloged by the site and we can scroll down and you'll be able to see every single essentially keyword. So if you want eyelashes, there are 21 videos that are tagged with eyelashes. And if we click on that, I think some of my videos will probably be in here, but there are also videos from Qno Design, who is a well-known Spark AR creator and Honor Matters, who is one of the first people I found actually uh, when I was learning how to make these filters. You can scroll down and see all the eyelash content. There's my videos here with terrible thumbnails from early 2020, just as I was getting started with my channel. Uh, we'll ignore those for now. There's probably better variations of this tutorial if you just click around. Uh, you can do this with games, you can do this with gallery texture, anything you can think of. LUTs are particularly popular. There are 131 videos with LUTs. So a lot of people in my comments ask about LUT filters, how to combine them with other effects. If we click on this, then you can scroll through and you can see how to create LUTs, how to import them into Instagram, combine them with different filter types and all kinds of cool stuff. I really can't recommend this website enough. It's awesome. One other thing I wanna mention is the channels section. So if we click this channels tab, at the top it will take you to this page which has categorized all of the videos according to the channel that uploaded them so you see here the person with the most uploads is this portuguese channel spark ar tutorials in portuguese with 171 videos if we click on that you can scroll through and see all of their videos again i don't speak portuguese but i have watched a few of these and they're quite easy to follow along with same with everyone on here Amelius vgs he's a very talented creator not just of spark ar content but also 3d modeling and VR and AR and just a lot of stuff. He's uh, very, very talented and I highly recommend, again, checking his channel out. He's the second most popular content creator in terms of Spark AR videos. Third is me, <laughs> weirdly, I wasn't expecting that. This is where I think most of my traffic comes from because in my analytics on YouTube, uh, about 8% of my views come from GitHub and I'm guessing that it's probably this website mirroring my content. So I'm very grateful to them for that. I appreciate that this site exists in the first place. Uh, and as you scroll down, you'll be able to see even more channels. There are some who make very, very few videos Videos, but they're extremely compelling and the content is incredible. Some people are so talented and they do crazy things that I could never dream of or imagine ever creating myself, but yeah. And as you scroll down, you'll see there are hundreds more creators all putting out Spark AR related content. Some are tutorials, some are the filter videos that I make, like the favorite filter series I have. Uh, others are just showcasing their own filters or promoting their Gumroad pages. But like I say, browse through the site, 
see what you can find uh, and it updates every day so there's so much content that you wouldn't otherwise be able to find on YouTube because on YouTube you're primarily restricted to what you search for so if you know the keywords you want you can probably find something related to that but on this site the keywords are all catalogued the channels are catalogued you can find new creators to subscribe to and it's generally just amazing there's also a search bar here so if you don't find the keyword that you want then you can type something in so we can type in Kira and search and all of the videos related to Kira Kira effects aka sparkles will show up obviously that's one that's here already so i don't know why you'd search for it but if there's a very specific thing like mocap suits maybe where very few people own that technology and it's quite a niche thing anyway uh, if you type that in then you might be able to find something so let's try motion capture and it will bring up all the results related to motion capture so as you can see here there's only one movement in capture and if we click on that it will take you straight to the youtube video where you can learn directly from, I presume, someone who's very invested in mocap technology and also Spark AR filters. Uh, so let's go back to the website. And the final thing I wanna show you is the sitemap here. So if you don't wanna use these sidebars along the left, right, or top, then you can come to the sitemap here and everything is just kind of listed out. You can search by weekly collections and I think, yeah, previous videos, it does go all the way back to 2019. You can search for videos specifically in English by week uh, and the same with all the languages. And as we scroll down, it's just cataloged and documented so well. I have nothing but praise for this website. So that's Spark AR TV. For anyone interested in making filters on Instagram and Facebook, this is a website I cannot recommend more highly. Like I say, it can be difficult searching by keyword on YouTube and finding the exact thing that you want, but with this website, you almost don't have to. Like you can stumble upon brand new ideas and be inspired every single day just by checking back regularly. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and you found this content useful, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more videos. If you saw this on Spark AR TV, maybe leave a comment letting me know that too, because that would be kind of cool to know. But anyway, that's the end of this video and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.